What's up, everybody? My name is Paul. I'm Luke. We are Twin Size. We're here with Giggle Mo and Matthew Moomore, and uh, we're here at Silver Silver Dollar City for the first time ever. Hey, for, for them. This is my third or fourth time. Yeah. I grew up going. First here, time. But it's been a first long time. time. First time. First time. It has been a long time since you've been here, right? I uh, I grew up like up until I was like six or so. I went almost every year, okay. and then which but I was so young, and then uh, I came again like four years ago. Yeah. We just kind of got up at like five o'clock this morning and came out here for the day. So we're gonna experience. Five thirty for me. Yeah, five. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna experience everything Silver Dollar City has to offer during a pandemic. So, heck yeah. First theme park with a mask. Yeah, first, first theme park with a mask. mask. I can feel it. <laughs> right down here. It's literally a bit. like ten minutes. <laughs> What did you guys think of the time traveler? Oh, I loved it a lot. Loved it. It was a lot. It was a lot. Oh man, it was. I did not quite expect it to be as intense as it was, but I was very impressed with how intense it was. Does that make Wildfire. You're so good. So good. You're so good. It reminded me of just like a classic good upside down, like loop to the roller coaster. Yeah. I need to eat something. I need to eat something too. I'm hungry. <laughs> it was worth it for the view. Yeah, the view. Like was... the view was so pretty. It was like luscious green mountain, uh, not mountain tops, um, whatever hills. I don't know, but it was beautiful. Oh, I want to spin this wheel of fortune. Wheel of fortune. <laughs> I would mix everything with that. Both, man. What? I'm getting both the ooey gooey butter cake and the molasses cookies. Molasses cookies from Nauvoo that my grandparents always got whenever they were going back to Nauvoo. They are the best things in the world. It's ooey gooey butter cake. What are you gonna get? I don't know yet. I don't know. Me neither. So, so good in so here. So good. For that. Chocolate Oreo whoopie pie, I think. Oh, yeah. I got this one. Right there. That one. Right here. Yum. What are you getting, Luke? I'm debating between what you got and one of these. Ooh, hey, if you get one of those, then I'll I'll, I'll go have these with you. We can do these little bites of each. Little bites of each. Let's see it. Gooey butter cake. How was it, Matthew Jones? Good. Is it like ice cream on the inside, yeah. or just a frosting or something? It's a frosting. Like a frosting. It's not ice cream. Oh, that's tasty. Yeah. Here, I was trying to pull this apart so we could try this. Yeah. We be uh, riding the train. Oh, yeah. Riding the train. Look at me. How was that long run? That was intense. That was intense. It's, I guess the the first um, wooden roller coaster to invert three times. Um, and it does like, so there's this one part where it does like a uh, kind of a loop thing that retracts. It does a double corkscrew. And then it does this thing where it like jumps up on the side and you just like ride it on a 90. And it's like intense. It was so much fun. I loved I it. I don't think I was expecting it to be like that insane. It was a and thrill. Also, it's like it a, a wooden ride. roller coaster, so it's a little shaky. And I was trying to hold my mask on, and I, I yeah. Like, <laughs> that was so fun. It was yeah, the best the meal Martin swing. <laughs> <laughs> it was so funny because we were on it, and we're like, "Is this worth it?" And Literally, then, that was it like took our thought ever. The last and then two we of waiting. yeah, then we got down there, and we're like, "Oh, this is gonna be really fun." Don't 
That ride was a ton of fun. We got soaked, but we did start a war with this, with this girl. We kind of soaked this one girl. She chased us around getting us real good. She deserved it. She deserved it. And we also deserved every bit of water we got. What do we get? I got a southern skillet. I don't know what I got. I got a chicken skillet I and I got a sausage skillet yeah. basically. You guys all get sausage? I think, yeah. The, yeah, I think the three of us all got sausage. sausage I wanted, had corn in it. I wanted, I, I wanted the chipotle sauce or whatever that was on the end of the, the, the chicken one. And But I really wanted sausage but uh, it's whatever. And I got a pickle. Mm -hmm. I, I wanted to get a pickle but I was like no, yeah, I'm okay. okay. How y'all doing? All these rides are very intense. And I feel like I'm getting old. I'm not what did you say earlier? They, all the rides jerk my neck and rattle my bones. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, he's not lying. Yeah. Uh, what have you thought overall, just with the parks? Just, what's your thoughts so far? It's a big frontier land. <laughs> it's a big frontier land. I think it's a good, good theming, intense rides. I think it definitely, it's, if you're gonna come, uh, come for, for like roller coasters and stuff. It is well themed. It's not like a uh, Cedar Point planet. Park or a Six Flags Park. It's, it has definitely better theming than those. And we're also only seeing a limited section of like a lot of like their like shows and sta stage things. There are some things around. Uh, most of them have been kind of cheesy or like just kind of fun. But it's like it's been good. I've I've enjoyed it. I think normally their shows are pretty like. Excellent. Like not excellent. Yeah. Yeah. on the excellent side. I don't. I yeah. can't say for but sure. But we also can't say for sure because most of them, because of due to like this stuff, they they're kind of limited to what they're doing. We also haven't seen any. We haven't tried to seek out any of them either because we've been waiting in line for roller coasters. Yeah, but I do feel old. Everything makes me more nauseous than it used to. <laughs> Everything. Too soon. Too soon. Rattle your. Church and I can rattle your bones. I'm not 17 anymore. Oh, yes. You mean 17, 17 again? again? <laughs> <laughs> we just got uh, off this ride called Fire in the Hole, and it's like an indoor, like dark ride, I guess, like what you'd see at Disney, and it was terrible. But it's we like terrible to compare it to this because it's not anywhere close to this. But it's kind of like Pirates of the Caribbean, where there's like scenes that you're following, but it's not at all like that because you can't follow it. It's it's a, one, it's a little too fast. Two, you don't know what the heck is happening, and then there's three, like what the heck moments where you like drop and stuff. But it was the funniest part of the whole ride was that Mariah leaned over to Matthew mid-ride and was like, this is stupid. I was like, this is stupid. I'm sorry, but this is like the dumbest ride I've ever ridden. Like, I, I've ridden a lot of great rides today and that was not what happened. <laughs> <laughs> 10 weird. thumbs no. down. <laughs> Mask Free Zones be like, I really like Silver, Silver Dollar City. I do feel, I feel like it's a little bit catawampus. Literally built around the cave. That's true. So I think it is just like sprung up. Yeah. Stop it, Matthew Jones, stop it. Oh, get it. Just as old as Mima. Paul, you should tell that story. All right. So on our way in to the park, <laughs> this lady was, we just walked past this lady and she was like telling her little girls and the grandma was there, I guess. But she was like, she was like, hey girls, did you know that this park is as old as Mima? <laughs> oh, <laughs> and you see these signs, I'm like, Mima is 60 years old. <laughs> it's not that funny. It is funny I when you was, were there. I thought it was You funny. had to be there. I thought it was funny. I wasn't there. Too soon. Little girl in a big chair. <laughs> <laughs> I feel <all> weird. <laughs> check my fanny pack. Been rocking it all day. Hip check, Hip check for Mariah. Fanny pack check. Got my 
hand sanitizer. And did you get birth beads in there too? And band-aids and everything? Beads, I got band-aids, I got a comb, I got... We're gonna be here all day if we on that. Lots of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I went to Silver Dollar City and all I got was this nerd's rope. <laughs> I see. I went to Silver Dollar City and all I got was this duck. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, well that is the end of our time at Silver Dollar City. Uh, we rode some like roller coasters that I didn't show, but they were all a ton of fun. I think one my overall impressions of Silver Dollar City was that it was really good. I think that the theming is consistent. Um, it's really charming. It's really cute. Um, other than that one ride, but uh, other than that, I think it was it's a really really neat place, and it's a lot of fun to bring your family to. A lot of fun family entertainment. Um, yeah, what'd you guys think overall? 10 out of 10, best new theme park in Branson. <laughs> best new theme park in Branson. 60 years. Best 60 years year old. old theme park in Branson. I really enjoyed myself. It was a fun time. Good park. Yeah. Two thumbs up. Anyway, that's all for us today. We'll see you guys in another adventure real soon. Don't die. Okay, bye. bye.